Hey guys, I'm Jonas Hopkins Brews, and it's March. That means beer is gonna be my new food for a while. So you may recall, last year I did a 46 long day beer only diet, which is a fasting diet for Lent that the polymer monks came up with almost 500 years ago. Now, during that video, I spent 46 days consuming nothing but beer, over 200 beers to be precise. If you don't believe me, check out the video. There, I don't remember. Anyways, it's a good video. Watch it. It's kind of long though. And if you're anywhere in the Pacific Northwest or a avid Reddit beer viewer, you probably saw my face a lot as I was posting well, like five times a day. <laughs> uh, got kind of got a few people mad uh, saying I was spamming. But one of the most common things I got during these postings was people replying back being, my brother did this, I've done that, my uncle does this, I've been doing this for 10 years. And then I would reply back to him, what are you doing? Well, I don't eat often, I just drink a lot. That's not doing it, I literally did not eat. But that kind of got me thinking. Now, doing only beer is, well, hard. It, it's just hard, it really is. And there's this thing called intermittent fasting, which has been shown to have huge health benefits to it. So I kind of wanted to see if I could combine the two. Can I consume only beer and intermittent fast at the same time. So instead of for 46 days, I'm going to tweak this just a bit. I'm going to see for the next 31 days, I'm going to only consume beer, except I will have one small meal a day. Everything else will be beer. Now during this, I will also be doing a workout because Part of the health benefits of the intermittent fasting is you also need to be active. It's supposed to help regenerate your cells. It's supposed to help with all of these vitamins, your spike levels, your proteins, your hormones, everything. It's supposed to do wonders. So now with the combination of working out, getting just enough proteins and vitamins in me that I can consume something, but not a huge amount. The meals will be quite small still, but then the rest of everything else will be beer. Theoretically, that should be easier, and I should be able to maintain this as a lifestyle for a very long time. And I should be able to lose weight and get healthy, mostly drinking only beer. Let's see what happens this month. So if this sounds interesting to you, please like and subscribe to this channel. Check out all my other videos. Now, if you're more interested in the full only beer diet, go ahead and check out the description below. It's going to have the links. I did a three part series where I talk about the history of the diet. I answer some questions and then I show you results and what happened to my blood work and inside all that good stuff. Hopefully I'll be doing even more of that in this video so we can see a bit more of a transition of what's going on. So stay tuned for March. Follow me. And well, yeah, let's all have a beer. See you guys.